this is a spring mass damper system in Excel. It's uh, a very good model to start numerical simulation with. Let's start the model. Hit start pause. Then jolt. Now damping is zero. So let's increase the damping to 0 0.2. Essentially what jolt does, the jolt operation moves the best base plate here holding this whole system back and forth by a distance of 0 0.7 meters. We can change this 0 0.7 meter, make, make it uh, 0 0.3 for instance, much smaller, or uh, make it 1. If we stop the model, we can pause it here, and start it any time from the same point. We see that uh, all the physics is in these three cells here. Essentially, the mass has three forces on it. It has the, it has the elastic force, the damping force, which is friction, and the inertia. And um, based on the position and the speed of the mass, we can we know these forces by integration. We can find the speed, and by an, a double integration, we can find the coordinate. We can reset it from here and start it again. While it's running, so during the run, we can change, say, the constant of the spring. We can change the mass. If we change the mass, the system becomes much faster. Similar effect uh, we can get by increasing the constant of the spring, the elastic constant. Let's decrease it again, uh, back. So um, the damping, we can reduce it to zero. <coughs> and we see here it's an undampened oscillation. We can increase the time step, and the simulation is going to be faster. But we run into the risk of convergence, lack of convergence, if we make it too large. <coughs> you can see here, if we increase it beyond, say, One second here. Run out of convergence. You see these very big numbers here. Let's put it back to zero point maybe twenty five and uh, increase the damping a little bit. You can see the oscillation dies out. If we increase the damping even more, zero point three. The oscillation will die out faster. We increase it to one. The critical critical reg regime. We have no oscillation. We can increase it increase it even more. And uh, unfortunately, we run out of convergence. Let's decrease the time step. See, it's coming back. This is, this is a stable simulation. The method is stable, provided the time step delta t is not too large. Reset this. Increase the mass. And decrease the damping ratio. So, there's a copy-paste macro which uh, runs the whole numeric scheme. The formulas are in these three cells, C22 to E22. Here, you can see the, I generated the graphics, the spring, the damper, and the mass. Mass is created by using sprites. 
uh, balls of various sizes which are brought into view just like uh, puppets in a puppet show so I created this uh, drawing first in PowerPoint define the gaps and the lengths and then insert them in formulas adjust them so that uh, it looks good this is the model you can download it from uh, excelunusual.com my site and uh, there you can also download the tutorial, a detailed tutorial on how to make this model let's stop this and bring up a new a new model which is a double spring mass damper system this one is similar, it has a little bit more formulas, it has two forces, two speeds and two coordinates we can start it and we can see how it runs we can jolt it we can change various parameters here while it's running and uh, this is another model you can download on my site excelunusual.com there is no tutorial for this one yet but I will be preparing one come over leave a comment a suggestion and come again thanks for watching